Bonjour. Des tomates. Mais on a des goûts. Oh, Valerie. The Andes are lovely. Throughout my filmmaking career, I always admired a fellow documentary filmmaker named Richard Leacock. I felt he was an important character. He's the magic of filmmaking. In our day, before everyone had their own little handy cam, their own little cell phone, making films was magic. Clarity used to ask when he was talking about how do you teach people to film. He said, how do you teach somebody to smell a rose? When digital cameras came out, he was one of the first people I shot with my digital camera. As Escoffier fatuously said, all cooking, at least French cooking, depends on the quality of your bouillon. What I really wanted to make was a film of Ricky being Ricky and telling his stories. And this is Mr. Flaherty around the time of Louisiana's story. How was he to work with? Flaherty? Yeah. I've never known anybody in my life before or since who looked at Russia's the way he did. Over and over again, until I was ready to scream. To me, it was a miraculous experience. Unique. What's the secret of having fun making movies? I know for me, it's trying to create the feeling of being there. When I first started making films, it was almost impossible to make something that gave you the feeling of being there because without synchronous sound and things, it was terribly difficult. We asked if I could be there in his private suite with a camera, nothing else, no tripod, no lights, no nothing, no questions, no interview, no, just me. We were the only people who had portable equipment at the time. He loved living and he loved being around people who had something to say, something to contribute. You've met a lot of extraordinary people. Well, the two that I liked the best, I think, or three, were Jawala Nehru. I adored Nehru. He treated me like a son. It was very, very nice. Louise Brooks. Ah, enough said. And Igor Stravinsky, who I absolutely adore. We became friends for life. I am delighted to speak with you, to know you, everybody. You know, that I am delighted. But I would be much more delighted to be on my piano and to compose music. Thank you very much. <laughs> that, that's absolutely true. I like looking at the world the way it is, and some of it's wonderful and some of it's horrible. This is what I like to do. Well, if you've been around him for an hour or two, you felt the window had been opened into a whole new world that was bright and promising. For me, it's the most exciting period in my life as a filmmaker. The digital video, I have no idea what's going to happen. Every day is exciting. I need to get organized. And my age, it tend to, takes a little while to get organized. <laughs> Especially if you like cooking and living in the country, and walking the dog on the beach, and being in love with a lovely person. But the one thing I can't do is die young, so I eat what I damn please. Come on,